hi to Chaco. What do we have? We have a uh, turtle rock, Blade Master here for Orc Worker. Hello, Blade Master. Is that a Jubei or is that a Mogul? Here we have a Demon Hunter for Mr. Sonic. Is that a Painkiller or is that a Dark Terror? We'll see in a moment. Thanks for the other host. Happy. Spasiba, happy. And, uh, a and Privia to Happy's viewers. Here's Mr. Demon Hunter. The Ancient War uproots. The Archer. The Ancient War hitting the turtle right in his face. And then again. And again. And again. And now he's going for the baby turtle. The sea turtle hatchling. The sea turtle hatchling dies. This, this, uh, this other turtle also dies. Demon Hunter with the slippers. This archer just shooting at this baby, uh, the sea turtle hatchling. Demon Hunter with slippers of agility. Blade Master with slippers of agility. Is he gonna attack? He has the money. Okay, he attacks. Nice attack here by Back to Warcraft Worker. <laughs> Orc Worker, also known. Uh, he's also known as Orc Worker. They both have the slippers. That's really nice. Taco should eat some taco flavored keysies. Taco, taco. There's a uh, mana burn. There's the burrow going up. The peon over here. Look how how smart Orc Worker is. Cutting this side of the trees with one peon. So if the Demon Hunter shows up, he can just block the Demon Hunter with this peon. So smart. Orc Worker, one of the smartest players in this game. Another really smart player in this game is Sonic, of course. He has a Demon Hunter. Mana burn for 34 on the Blade Master. Blade Master is pretty strong. Going killing turtles. Archers, okay. Is he going for three archers? It looks like it. He's probably gonna creep this with the archers, guys. You see this? One, one, two, three. And that's how many archers you need to creep the turtle. You looks hungry. I am not that hungry. Actually, I'm not that hungry. I first of all, I ate chicken before the stream. Second of all, I drank a lot of uh, spinach during the stream. Spinach juice. Just blended spinach. So I'm not that hungry, actually. No, not at all. Hellburn with the circlet. He wants his grunt. Grunt takes a bit of damage. Demon Hunter is done attacking the grunt. Oh, wait a second. What is, is he going for this one? Or is he... What's he doing? He's not going for this one. You see the Blade Master going for this Ogre Magi. The Ogre Magi takes a lot of damage. <laughs> Talisman of Evasion, not really what you're looking for in this matchup. We'll probably sell it the next opportunity he has. The Grunt here shows up. The Demon Hunter gets that Ogre Magi. Close of Attack plus 9. That's pretty good. That's a really good one. Like most of these items, they are like more survival items, right? Ring of Protection plus 3, Parry Up of Vitality, uh, Evasion. You don't want any of those on your Demon Hunter. You want the damage, right? So he gets damage, plus 9 damage. Also, you don't want the boots either. You already have the boots. You already bought the boots before you killed the ogre, I think. Blade Master here was his wisp. And the archers, oh, now they're going to creep the turtle. The wisp is still alive. And Pendant of Energy is also not that great here for Night Elf. So, really, these items are not all just... All of these items are pretty shitty for Night Elf. Besides this, this class of attack plus 9. Well, and the boots, but... A player's forces are he already has the boots. Demon Hunter bots his grunt. Here comes the Demon Hunter and the Beast Master. And of course the Blade Master. He has to defend, so he doesn't have the time to check this. These archers. And he cannot just show up and be like, Hello archers, and let me kill you. The grunt's defending, but the grunts are going to die. So Sonic, he's not only killing turtles and murlocs. At the same time, he's killing grunts. This grunt is pretty dead, guys. This grunt, if he wants a grunt, he's dead. But he wants bestiary first. He can... Oh, that's something he could do. First kill the bestiary, then the grunt. But he changes his mind. He goes for the grunt first. Now, I don't like that too much, you know? I like... Because now the bestiary is going up. But he could have cancelled the bestiary and then killed the grunt. Easy peasy. But actually, now he might be able to escape. I mean, the beastmaster somehow is outside of the base now. Some more piggies. Demon hunter. We'll have to TP, though. See, I mean, if he did what I uh, wanted him to do, he would have been in much better shape. But Sonic is still in really good shape. He's probably going to win this game. <laughs> yeah, you say this so soon in the early in the game, Chaco. Yes, because Sonic is very, very far ahead now. 
he is very, very... Hey, there's a Tree of Eternity. What do we have here? Just a Stronghold. Raiders with the Snare. Uh, Spirit Walkers. I mean, killing two grunts for TP. Look, he has to creep now with the Blade Master for sure. And even then, it's, it's pretty difficult to creep. If he had two more grunts, this would be so much easier. Ancient War goes for a walk. Druid of the Talon is initiate. He's getting adapt. Evasion. Oh, not that great here for the Demon Hunter. Piggy will scout this. Um, what do we get here? Scourge Bone Chimes. Okay, pretty good one, actually. This is a really good one in this matchup. Piggy wakes up the turtles. Ancient of War eats a tree. And this turtle is going down, guys. He's going down. DC wants this turtle, guys. He wants to eat some turtle soup. The wisp hangs out in the tree over there, so he knows. Oh, this... Spirit Walker, it's not the unit that you want to tank turtles with. TC picks up a nice gauntlet. What item did we get here? Wand of mana stealing. You can steal mana now. D100 level 3, Beastmaster level 2. Uh, Blade Master gets mana burned. Forces are under attack. These dudes of Talon are adept and you know soon they will be master. Actually soon they will take some time. He's now a tree of eternity. Now he needs to get a master upgrade. There it is. Cancel that other druid of the Talon. Druid of the Talon. And meanwhile the blade master is seen by the birdie and by the fairy fire. The piggy wants that uh, blade master. TC going for this turtle. The heroes are just so strong for Sonic. Orc worker. What can he do? He can, besides killing these turtles over there. The TC, is that enough for level 3? That will be enough for level 3. But look at the supplies. Sonic at 43 supply. That's without the Tinker. Without the Tinker, though. So, in other words, he can still buy the Tinker, get to 48 supply. Three archers. Archers aren't weak, though, because he killed the Grunts, right? Normally, archers aren't that strong because the Grunts killed the archers. But since he killed all the Grunts, there's only one Grunt. And this Grunt is not an archer killer. I mean, because he will die to the Druze of the Talon before he can kill the archers. And then the archers are gonna tank so much radio damage and spirit walkers. Archers take like zero damage from radius or spirit walkers. So they can tank, they can be annoying, they can stand in the way. Depending on uh, how good the micro is here by uh, Sonic. Blade Master is level 3, TC is level 3. The peons though, they are archer killers. And of course the heroes are always pretty good against archers as well because they're so low on hit points. Demon Hunter buys uh, nothing. Okay, he has a healing potion on the Beastmaster as well. Where's the Tinker? There's the Tinker. He, he doesn't want to give this item for free to Orc Worker, but he gives it for free to Orc Worker. Uh, nice Hood of Cunning. Not really a nice item, but that's the item he gets. Demon Hunter gets ensnared. Sonic definitely wants to fight. Orc Worker still has 49 supply only. He doesn't have the second healing scroll. There's no way he can win this fight, but he doesn't have a TP. Maybe the Blade Master should buy a TP or something? Like, what can he do here? Is he forced to fight? If Orc Worker is forced to fight, guys, it's going to be horrible. Orc Worker going over 50. There's a Pocket Factory. Can he escape now? Let's see. Can he escape? Oh, look at this escape. This is like, uh, you know, one of those movies. Escaping from prison. Orc worker escaping from Sonic. A player's forces are under attack. This piggy is ensnared, guys. And dispelled. Poof. Mana burn on the TC. That's nice. Fairy dragon is in the air. The demon to get ensnared. The Raiders are 0 0. Demon Hunter, Beast Master, and the Tinker. Here they come. Demon Hunter does get ensnared. This Raider, what is it doing? Okay, finally it goes in the text. No, and now it retreats. The Raider John is uh, very low. Blade Master flying over there. The Raider is dead. Does he surround the Blade Master? Maybe he goes for it. There's a Shockwave, though, hitting a lot of units. But of course, we still have a healing scroll here for Sonic that he could use at any time. He has two of them, even. 
And uh, Blade Master used the info potion now. He wants this Demon Hunter. This is the only way to come back in this game. Seven man man burn on the TC. This Demon Hunter uh, is still alive. And the Blade Master is flying. Oh no, he's back on the floor. He's flying now. Uh, Demon Hunter is going to die. So is that a comeback here? Yeah, I think so. Because Sonic, I mean, lose the Archer to the Blade Master. These archers are just standing in the middle of the Druze of the Talon instead of shielding off uh, the, the raiders. But sure, I mean, that's pretty difficult to micro. Uh, only someone like Moon or Life could uh, micro those archers there. But the Team Hunter is back. And now the Tinker uh, takes a healing potion. Does he use it at all? He does use it. A uh, Demon Hunter can't die anymore. There's not enough raiders, so he, he has staff. So he can always staff the Demon Hunter out at this point. And, you know, oh, he has four raiders actually still. Never mind. I thought he only had two raiders left. Blade Master is Cyclone, but you know, this fight is still anyone's game, guys. Still anyone's game. Okay? Okay. A player's forces are um, what a beautiful game, guys. Up time, wow. This is such a short stream today. I can't believe it. No, I can't believe it, Chaco. You, you can't believe it. Demon Hunter and the Beastmaster, they just killed a turtle. It gives a greater healing potion to the Demon Hunter. Pretty good item. What is the Blade Master gonna buy here? Arr, info potion, healing scroll, of course. And let's see what item he gets over here. He still has the Hood of Cunning as well. This Blade Master, plus 9 agility, 26, uh, 36 agility. But here, look who shows up. It is Sonic. Sonic the Hedgehog. I mean, this is a Hedgehog kind of, right? This is a cool beast, but Demon Hunter, look at this item. He will use it. See, he uses it. Piggy over there. Where did the Beast Master go? Oh, there he is. Uh, this Druid of Talon killed by four raiders. Wow. This this Druid of the Talon, I mean, he could go birdie form or anything. Hello, Sonic. You can micro even. Okay, Sonic not microing his uh, Druids of the Talon that aren't even ensnared. This is uh, a mistake you see a lot of Nidus players make. Demon Hunter gets staffed out. There goes another Druid of the Talon. Now Raider attacking an uh, Archer. That's not very smart. Okay, and of course he micros the Raider. He realizes this Druid of the Talon could be micro. Hello, Beastmaster does go down. So that was kind of important also to micro. I'm not sure if he could have done something there. I was just looking at these Druids of the Talon and the Raiders. This Raider survives with 10 hit points. Where's the Demon Hunter? He's coming back, guys. With the healing potion. With, uh, you know, his, uh, his, his items. Tinker is doing great for a little bit. He could give the healing potion to the Tinker, but it's too late now. Ah, Tinker is dead. Sonic Sonic is up in supply, though. So even though he lost a few heroes here. 50 man man burn, that's bad. 180 critical strike. Demon Hunter has a healing potion. Don't forget about it. He uses it. This Raider is very low on hit points. The Spirit Walker goes down. Orc Worker only really has his heroes left. He has, you know, a few units here and there. Spirit Walker there. Raider there. Raider there. But... Sonic, I mean, he has more units, but less heroes. What a game. Nice mana burn. How's your weekend, Chaco, so far? My weekend so far has been Chaco. Uh, good. Casting Worker 3. All well, weekend, guys. It's, uh, yeah, pretty good. And the weather is good as well. So that's why my weekend has been so amazing. There's a nice fairy fire on the Blade Master. Demon Hunter, he's gone by. And think Archer Town, what was she doing over there? She dies to 156 critical strike. Beastmaster, Tinker. Tree of Life. Sonic wants this item, but he doesn't have a TP. It's pretty risky. Blade Master and Grog Bloodhorn on their way. Grog Bloodhorn almost level 5, guys. Level 3 Shockwave is going to be insanely powerful. A snare on the Ogre. And the Demon Hunter just creeping this instead. Now I'm getting hungry. Now I'm getting hungry. What who was it? Zack Zack? Zack Zack, it's all your fault. That I'm getting hungry. Demon Hunter doing uh, just fine over here. There's a Tinker. Where's the Beastmaster? There he is. He's level 3. What do we get here? What item did we get here? Uh, second Hood of Cunning. Okay. Not really a good item. Really not that good. Right, there, there are worse items, of course. Django of Endurance would be worse, for example. Uh, Crystal Ball would be worse. But these items, it's just... Your heroes are mostly flying. Extra stats that don't help you that much. Extra mana doesn't help you that much. Because you get mana burned. Extra agility doesn't help you that much. Because you don't take damage and you don't deal damage. You're just flying. Just flying. Constantly flying. 
Of course, Sonic doesn't want to fight. He just wants the expansion to get up. And he doesn't want Orc Worker to scout it. TC is level 5 though. He's pretty strong. The main is 3k gold left. And look at this. He's creeping two creep camps at the same time. What a play here by Orc Worker. Both of these heroes are level 5. So he doesn't need more XP. He just needs to kill all the creeps. So that uh, Sonic cannot get more creeps. Sonic has 432 heroes. His heroes are pretty weak sauce. Pretty spaghetti. But... He has this expansion and it's hidden and no one knows about it besides us. Don't tell anyone, guys. A player's forces are under attack. Forces are under attack. Oh, what is this guy doing? Is he gonna scout? I think he was planning to get his own expansion, but instead he will scout this tree now. Does he see it? He sees it, right? Come some wisps. They're going into the gold mine. Hello, peon. Hello. Hello, peon. Blade Master, level 3 critical strike, of course. TC, level 3 shockwave, of course. And potion of greater mana. This is a really good item here on the level 5 TC. Like, usually I'm not too impressed with the mana items on the DC when he's still level 3 or 4. But when he when he hits level 5, every drop of mana is just worth so much on the DC. Blade Master flying. Do we see a shockwave? Demon Hunter's kind of stuck behind the dudes of the Talon. Demon Hunter gets ensnared, of course. He wants to, uh... He doesn't want the his DC to get mana burned. 200 critical strike here on the demon hunter. Use the info potion. Do we see this shockwave? Oh, because I uh, did this, you don't see, you didn't see the damage it dealt. But anyway, uh, Drews of Talon took a lot of damage. There's a healing scroll. DC gets mana burned, and another shockwave hit, it kills some Drews of Talon. Does a lot of Drews of the Talon damage. And where's the Tinker? No healing scrolls. Beast is dead. Sonic, it looks like he's just dying here. I mean, the next shockwave. Hello, GG. There's Blade Master. Do we have a board in here? No, demon hunter. With the Ancient of War over here. But the peon is scouting it. Because Orc Worker knows how Sonic plays. And he knows that Sonic often builds the Ancient of War. And he creeps this with the Demon Hunter. So he's just going to scout it. And then he knows like. Okay Mr. Blade Master is going straight for this this place. And kill everything. The Wisp here is scouting as well. The, the peon doing a scout as well. The tree is doing his dance. He's doing his dance. It's beautiful. Demon Hunter will be here soon. Uh, shop is going up. Blade Master. Wisp. Burrow, Town Hall, Great Hall, Peons. Peons cutting down the trees. Four Peons together. They form a team of the tree cutting Peon squad. And this Peon, you know, he sees the Angel of War. There's a Wisp. And the Wisp, I mean, that's not a Wisp. How come I sometimes call archers Wisps? That just doesn't make sense, Jaco. It, they don't even look like Wisps. Archer blinking a little bit with her eyes. Attacking this Peon. This peon here taking quite a bit of damage. But here comes the grunt, here comes the blade master. And archer suddenly not that <laughs> not that confident anymore. Here's Mr. Demon Hunter. He did hear that blade master. Is it worth sitting down over here? What is that archer going to? What's he going to do? Blade Master Boss, Dust and Circlet. He wants to kill Mr. Archer. And he, he starts by chopping her up. That's a good way to uh, kill an archer, guys. Just chop her up. Demon Hunter with Immolation? Okay. Hello. Hello, Sonic. You're playing against Orc. Maybe he doesn't realize he's playing against Orc. This Archer drinks some Moon Juice. And she continues to run. Demon Hunter now going for the gun. There's no one in the burrows. Okay, now he puts one peon in the burrow. This peon in the burrow. This peon in maybe that burrow. I'm pretty sure this burrow is also in reach. Uh, the grunt here is probably going to die sometime soon. The Immolation is beautiful. Okay, the, the grunt gets away. Blade Master, did he kill Mr. Archer? No, the Archer, she's hiding over there. This Wisp, oh, Wisp goes down though. 25 XP for Die Show. Rage Runner wants his grunt. The peons are kind of hurt because uh, they got burnt a little bit. Blade Master wants his Moonwell. No, he doesn't. He wants the Archer and he, oh, he knew he saw the Archer or something. Archer, she, she's dead guys. Mr. Archer is dead. Hopefully you uh, weren't too attached to her. The Demon Hunter, he got a grunt. 60 XP. But there's another Wisp. The Blade Master killed two Wisps and Archers. Hello. That's just a lot. He's like a, a murderer. 
He's not going for the moon well, but moon well is up. There's some more archers. He, he's building a lot again a lot of archers. Archers, I feel like archers are really good in this matchup if you can keep them alive. If they don't die to Mr. Blade Master. If you can creep with the archers, you're just gonna get so much XP and your heroes are gonna be so strong. And then you just you will own, you know, the orc player later game. But they're kinda expensive, so uh for what they do late late game. And if he still has grunts, he can kill them with the grunts. With the speed scrolls, with the blade master, it's just the archers are just going to die. So he has two grunts now. And he wants to creep this. But the archers is perfect, but Blade Master, he knows what's up. He's going for the Demon Hunter. Nice hit. But he's out of mana now. So what can he do? The Ace of the War taking some damage, but he can eat more trees. Here come the grunts though. Here come the grunts. The Demon Hunter has boots. The Blade Master does not have boots. And remember, there's no uh, Windwalk mana, but there's no mana burn mana either. I mean, there's no skill. No mana burn skill. He has Immolation first. The Ace of the War went down, which is a pretty big loss. There's no overseer, pretty low on hit points. The demon hunter, though, he will have to retreat, drink some moon juice. Can the archers buy enough time to save the null overseer? That's right, Sonic wants to save the null overseer so he can kill him himself. Such an evil person. But the uh, orc worker does get the null. He gets the ring protection plus three, though, not a great item. And the grunts, I mean, the grunts, they want the archer. They're running, oh, they don't get the archer. This archer takes some damage. Hello, Grunty Punty. This Grunty Punty is probably dead, guys. But can he take an archer with him? Yes, he takes one archer with him. Ooh, Naga. Hello, Naga here for Sonic. Hello. Can he get the Grunt, though? He should maybe should have given the boots here to the Naga. Speed scroll. Okay, speed scroll to save the Grunt. TC coming out. TC coming soon. Is he going even for Judas of the Talon? I don't even know. He went Demon Hunter first, Immolation, Naga second with the, uh, you know, the Cold Arrow. Well, actually, we saw the Double Angel of Wind earlier already. So, yeah, he is going just for Judas of the Talon at some point. There's Adapt. We don't have Lumber to buy a single Druid of the Talon at the moment. Demon Hunter and the Naga just killing some Nulls, sure. But what do we see here? We see. Orc worker going for a troll warlord. And he's just killing this troll warlord. And he gets healing wards. Okay, that's pretty good. He can just uh, continue creeping. Easy peasy. This demon hunter gets a nice close of attack. Ace of the wonders going up. Ace of the winds are up. For Moonwells, he drinks some uh, juice here. Demon Hunter is still level 1, which is nice. Naga is still level 1. Blade Master level 2, critical strike, 82 damage there. TC is almost level 2. Oh, what is this? A scout again. Nice scouts. I like these peon scouts here. Every peon scout has been worth a million bucks, guys. First the peon scout here, now this peon scout here. Orc worker, he's like the peon scout master. These archers. Oh, does he get the last hit? No. Demon Hunter gets the last hit. Book of the Dead. Uh, this raider here takes a bit of damage. He used the Book of the Dead, but he didn't surround the raider. I think he was planning to, but or maybe he just, you know, maybe he wasn't planning to. Maybe this is just good enough. Kills the raider. Skeleton's blocking the archers here, or saving the archers uh, from the Blade Master. Druid of the does go down, though. This Spirit Walker doesn't have this boy yet, so. So early Book of the Dead. I do like the early use of the Book of the Dead. If you wait even like five seconds longer, this Spirit Walker would have uh, had the dispel already. Blade Master kills the archer. Shockwave on the skeleton archers and the Naga. Naga takes a bit of damage, but she, of course, she just slithers away like a, like a snake. Snake! The Grunt here, very long hit points, but Spirit Walker just blocking the Demon Hunter. Naga-chan is going to drink some moon juice. Nom, nom, nom. She has backup over here as well. She should be able to defend against these two little heroes. And the Demon Hunter, he just, you know, he wants more kills. The skeletons are still powerful. He's getting Dispel now. He's using the skeletons to get this Null Overseer, level 5. There's some purchase, but still, Demon Hunter will get this item. Ring of Regeneration. Not actually that bad, considering uh, the circumstances. He's low on hit points. 
He's kind of low on moon juice. So, yeah. Not a bad item here. For Sonic. If the Blade Master showed up out of nowhere, though, this Demon Hunter would be dead. Just letting you guys know. One hit, one kill. So expensive to heal now with immolation? Yeah. It's expensive. A player's forces are under attack. Skeletons going for the scouting peon. This time the scouting peon not really uh, gonna do much. <laughs> and these skeletons are all very low hit points. Ready could maybe just kill them and get some XP. Like this skeleton would be one hit, one shot. I mean one kill. But there they go. Pew. They expired. Sonic at 43 supply. Orc worker at 47. I wonder what hero will get 30 for Sonic. Is it gonna be the... Tinker, I assume it's gonna be the Tinker. He kept doing regeneration to the Naga. Okay. TC is not level 3 yet. There was a level 2 mana burn. Of course, the Demon Hunter doesn't have evasion, he has immolation still. Level 1. This grunt takes a lot of damage. Sonic doesn't want to fight up onto the high ground, but I think he could have just taken this fight easy peasy. Sonic has uh, only 5 supply behind. He does have Master Juice of the Talon. He has. Uh, okay, he just bought an Info Potion and Heal Scroll, but we have no Info Potions or Heal. Oh, Blade Master has an Info Potion and Heal Scroll. These units were hurt before he used the Healing Ward. Yeah, I think Sonic could have taken the fight there, but he was afraid. He didn't know he was uh, still in pretty good shape in this game. There's a Sentry Ward now for the Demon Hunter. Demon Hunter is kind of low on hit points now, thanks to the creeps. Did he just grab? There goes the Druid of the Talon. And Blade Master used the Info Potion, Demon Hunter used the TP though. And this, this Raider might die, but the Spirit of uh, Druid of Talon does die. The Raider does survive, easy peasy. Easy peasy. And Sonic, he probably just wants a third hero before he fights. Right, that's uh... That's what he really wants, a third hero. He's out of moon, uh, juice. So this, ra this Ring of Regeneration, he, he bought a Healing Potion. Look how much hit points it's giving him, this game guys. There's just hit points he wouldn't have if it wasn't for this ring. Because he, he doesn't have more moon juice. He doesn't have any other way to heal. So this is just literal more hit points on this de Demon Hunter this game. So beautiful. Demon Hunter level 3, Naga level 2. Some raiders. Worker went over 50, but only to 53 supply. He wants more, of course. He has nowhere info potion. He has two healing scrolls. A player's forces are under He's getting more spirit walkers. He's going to 56. The TC and the Blade Master finish that creep camp. Demon Hunter over here. We have a Tinker third. Blade Master is invisible, guys. Did he buy something? I'm not sure if he just bought it. Yeah, he just bought the Info Potion. Really? A Sonic should have bought that one. I'm sure why Sonic just let the uh, Blade Mash buy that one. Anyway, we have this uh, beautiful fight here. Immolation used here on the Demon Hunter. That's so nice. Uh, the Blade Master with the Invo Potion. Uh, he's going for the Naga. The Pocket Factory also goes down. Healing Scroll used here. Tinker in the front here. Demon Hunter with the Immolation next to the TC. TC is out of mana. He has a Rune Bracers, of course. So he doesn't take as much damage from uh, the Mana Burn. But I think the Immolation still does normal damage. I'm not sure. This, this panda, this TC, is, uh, is he dead, guys? The TC is dead. But what did Sonic sacrifice to kill the TC? A lot of dudes of the Talon dead. As you can see, three dudes of the Talon just died. This uh, Pocket Factory placed here. Daga is, has an Info Potion. She might have to use it here in a moment as she uses it. The Tinker is low. There's no staff. He does have a Healing Potion on the Demon Hunter, but doesn't want to use it for the Tinker. And uh, it's just a Demon Hunter, really, that's left. Tinker is pretty much dead. Like, Blade Master is gonna kill him. Ah, with the Raiders. The Demon Hunter and the Fairy Dragon. They attack a peon. Demon Hunter going south. We have a Naga over here. It's looking pretty bad for Sonic, guys. He's a 29 supply against 50. And that's what happens when you don't have a Beastmaster, by the way. 
Just letting you guys know that that's why he lost. <laughs> Blade Master, what does he buy? Info Potion, nice. This guy's very low on hit points, but he's, he doesn't care. He's just hunting down this Demon Hunter. Demon Hunter John. No, he's going to creep. Okay, he's just going to creep. Oh, where are those guys? Here they are. Hello, Peon. Peon finally gets a Demon Hunter that was ensnared. Not very smart, Peon. Hello. That's like uh, trying to fight a, a chained dog. Sp two spirit walkers dying very fast. The Naga though, she uh, takes a healing potion. And she's trying to run, but you know, maybe... Uh, okay, you can Cyclone, the Blade Master. And of course, some kills here. There was a good fight by Sonic. Suddenly Sonic is up in supply. He got so much here without losing anything. Hello, look at the supply. Suddenly 42 against 36. I thought Orkwork had won the game, but he didn't go back home to heal. He, he was too greedy, going for the creep camp at the bottom left. And that might have just... Lost him the game. He might have just thrown away the game. Blade Master, level 5. He's killing Druze of the Talon here. He kills another one. But is he... Uh, oh, he's out of mana. Blade Master is going to die. And, he, and GG. Orc Worker loses a one game, right? This game was won, right? Didn't Orc Worker win this game? All he had to do is go home. Heal, back up, wait for his TC. I thought he was going to win. He was like 20 supply up. GG. Well, we have a Demon Hunter here for Mr. Sonic. Kappa, Knight of Kappa. And here we have a Blade Master for Orc Worker. Kappa, Orc, Kappa. Here comes a Wisp for Sonic. Peon is cutting down a tree. C U T T I N G. First come marriage, then come a uh, war meal. A player's forces are under attack. Grunt and Blade Master. Mr. Demon Hunter, almost out, guys. He's almost out. <laughs> Game of throw. <laughs> Where is Mr. Demon Hunter? There he is. Here he is, guys. Sin Dweller. We have a wisp over here. There's Mr. Tojara. Tojara's on his way. Sin Dweller killing some creeps. Tome of Agility is that so nice. Look at this agility. 23 now. He's almost as agile as the Blade Master. And now he kills, kills his last guy. Circlet, he is now 25 agility. He's more agile than the Blade Master who on his 24. Blade Master going for the assassin. Hello, bye bye assassin. Oh, he, he's going for the next creep. He buys a circlet, not a circlet. Demon is super duper powerful. What about Tojara? He gets a close of attack. Okay, he does a bit more damage. There's a good item. There's an item you want. Demon Hunter kills one of these guys. Lol, I thought the game was already won by Worker. Yeah, I think a lot of us thought that. Demon Hunter with the gauntlet. He has now 800 hit points. He has 28 agility. He is pretty strong. Blade Master, does he get the slippers? No, he gets a mantle of intelligence. Not really amazing item here. There's a dust. There's a mana burn right in his face. Grunt retreating. Retreating to his base or to somewhere. He's going somewhere, guys. He's a two. I mean, 450 hit points. Two more burrows going up here in the back. Woo! Hello, Chaco. Hello, Captain Crunchbot. Wow, you sound like a cereal, Captain Crunchbot. I want to eat some cereal now. But I don't have any cereal. Demon Hunter wakes up these little bandits. He's saying, hello, I'm over here. The bandits are saying hello. Hello, Sintweller. Hello. Blade Master, does he get the slippers now? No, another mantle of intelligence. He sold the other one. He's gonna sell this one. The archer shot the grunt. She could have gotten the last hit on the wizard. Could have gotten uh, 20 more XP or 18 more XP, but whatever. This archer, she's uh, blocking the Blade Master. Demon Hunter with the boots as well. He's strong, he's fast, he's the perfect warrior. Blade Master, on the other hand, he is smart, he is he does has some claws, but he's he's far from the perfect warrior in this case. This, this archer she's hiding. Warriors don't have to be smart. Hello, 21 IQ. We have 22. Actually, the demon hunter is still smarter than the blade master, even with this mantle of IQ. This archer here standing in the way. So annoying. This gun's just healing in the back. Team Hunter wants to cancel a heal solve or something, but the peon was blocking. 
There is a TC. There is the Spirit Lodge. And where's the Beastmaster? I don't know. Uh, Demon Hunter takes some damage. He is a Tree of Ages now. What? Why did he cancel the Spirit Lodge? Uh, what? Was it a mistake? There's a bestiary going up. There's a spirit lodge going up. What? Okay. <laughs> the right one is my homie. For my homie! <laughs> oh, the archer goes down, but the demon hunter and the beastmaster, they cancel the bestiary. Uh, not the bestiary, the spirit lodge. Demon hunter takes some damage, but... You know, who cares? He, he moves so fast, he can't die. Blade Master, what item does he get? A Ring of Protection, not really what he wanted. Bestiary, is he in trouble? No, Demon Tree is in trouble. Here comes the Blade Master with a speed call. Maybe he can catch the Demon Hunter. 40, 50 hit points. No, Demon Hunter is safe, guys. Beastmaster, he's in a bit of trouble, though. There's no uh, way to... S I mean, there's plenty of hit points. He can just walk home. But there's no staff there or anything. Is what I wanted to say. This piggy, they, they killed the creep and now they're going for the grunt. <laughs> These piggies, man. MVPs. Both, the, both of them. Look at the Beastmaster. He had 24 XP. Okay, the grunt was not killed by the piggies. But the creep was, the rogue. Now this piggy is trying to get the next rogue. Beastmaster and Sintweller retreating. We're going home with piggy here. Piggy working on the uh, the building here. This building taking some damage. Spirit Lodge is what it's called. Bestiary, 780 hit points. Does he think he can finish the rogue? Maybe he can finish off this rogue, guys. Instead of going for these buildings that, you know, Piggy does nothing here. Wait, what's the Beastmaster doing here? What? What is he doing here? Is he going for the Bestiary? <laughs> okay, sure, yeah. You do you, Sonic. There are some more ancient of uh, winds building Druze of the Talon. The Blade Master and the TC is creeping a creep camp. Potion of greater healing means that the, you know the Blade Master is not going to die anytime soon. But overall, it's just a pretty shitty item. There's a Berserker. Are under well, I guess in this situation it could be useful. Maybe it's going to use it right here. Yeah, Bestiary only 800 uh, hit points left. Good job, uh, Piggy Master. Kappa. 90 critical strike there. And the Blade Master. I mean, he has nothing to fear. What's his Wisp doing here? He sees the rogue. Oh, Wisp is taking some damage. Hello, Wisp. Okay, going into that tree. Demon Hunter. There's a radar over there. There is a radar. Beastmaster, go for the bestiary. I feel bad now because we eat your friends with milk. Okay, there goes the beast. Wait, what? I used the separate to get the bestiary for sure. I okay, this is what you do, guys. I was thinking like Sonic is just, you know, he's just fooling around. He's never going to get a bestiary. No, he uses a stepper. A stepper to get a bestiary. And how many raiders are we uh, going to get? Oh, he has one. He has one raider. And now spirit walkers okay this is the way you play the game guys just learn from sonic even i'm learning i forgot about sappers because normally we don't see sappers used against orc you know they're usually used by orc against other races not against orc how is this even fair sappers should be an orc only unit i mean it's a goblin goblins and orcs we all know they uh, they're both green so they they relate to each other This guy, does he wake? Oh, he wakes up the enforcers. Enforcers are going for Mr. Spirit Walker. Is he adept yet? Is he going for adept at any time soon? Orc Worker, he definitely needs some berserkers this game. He's, re he's rebuilding the bestiary. What he needs to do is buy two berserkers and just get. Oh, he has one. Okay, nice. What he needs to do is buy one more and then maybe one more, one more. Sonic is just killing creeps and stuff. Sobe Mask here on the Beastmaster is nice. Blade Master is also nice. Tojara is level 3. And also Harpy Slayer is also level 3. Scourge Bone Chimes, really nice item. Uh, not if you're not going Raiders though. Actually, he's not that great of an item because his Beastiary got killed by a Sapper. So, 
is only melee units is this one raider and this one, these two grunts and if he listens to me and gets more berserkers instead of more raiders of course he will get some more raiders as well but they'll be delayed then uh yeah he won't have much to scourge bone chimes his heroes are in in theory melee but because they're always in the air they don't you know regenerate much hit points the hunter is not level three yet beastmaster is not level three yet guys not level three yet peggy la cochone hey fanny aloha Aloha, Wooly Pig. Hello. Hello, Wooly Pig. We all know you're actually a sheep. The Beastmaster buys the Tinker. And the Demon Hunter is level 3 now. So, there's a second raider. Hmm. Sonic 46 supply. Orc Worker at 48. He doesn't buy more Berserkers. Maybe because of this scourge bone chimes he wants to make sure he can get as many raiders as he possibly can but he's staying under 50 48 supply there goes mr peon he has now three supply to build another unit and he builds another raider that's what he wants he wants the raiders he wants he wants the raiders guys hello hello anders bergen He's going for the beast here again. Nice choke wave. Actually, he shouldn't really be going for the beast area. It's perfect uh, choke point. The peons are repairing the beast area. The raiders now going for this Druze of Talon or something. Nice shock wave hits a lot of Druze of Talon. Do we have a healing? No, but we have a TP. Actually, we do have a healing scroll, but he doesn't use it. He TPs out. And he is out of there. Sonic going for an expansion. Sneaky Sonic with the expansion. New meta by Sonic. Kill building. Not in construction. Sonic in the future. Sonic with the future meta. We have illusions here. Illusions for Orc Worker. And this Ancient of War. What is he up to? He's up to no good. Tinker level 1. Sin Dweller level 3. Gazi, Bortusk level 2.5. Wait, how come we have two Gaz? Look. Look at the names. The Beastmaster, Gaz. The Tinker, Gaz with double Z. <laughs> What is this? What's about the Demon Hunter? He's Sintweather. Why don't you name him a Gaz with three Z's? Hello. Gaz, Gazzy and Gazzy, guys. These are twins, I guess. Oh, this is going to be cancelled. Tree of Life. Bye-bye. Dead night there on the Raiders. Meanwhile, he kills this little Geomancer. Sorry uh, to see your friend die, Mr. Cobalt. In my chat. He survives actually, but you know, he almost died. 48 mana burn on the Blade Master, and he gets uh, very fired as well. What about Headhunters against Talons? No, Headhunters not that good. Headhunters have less range, they have less damage output, they have less uh, hit points. They're just all around worse than Berserkers. Berserkers are just better units. There goes the Ancient of War. Also, you need the War Mill for the Headhunters. You don't need the War Mill for Berserkers. There's just so many reasons why Berserkers are so much better than Headhunters. Do you guys remember 12 Berserkers from Warcraft 2 Super Imba? I don't remember. <laughs> I never played Warcraft 2. Chotax, I think they said. Chotax. Chotax. Wait, they collect the text, the Berserkers in Warcraft 2? Okay. Well, we have Sonic 59, Orc Worker 65, these Raiders ensnaring some Druids of the Talon. This Raider, Raider is flying. He's in, up in the air. Look at them flying. There's a shockwave. He hits a few of these dudes of the Talon. Uh, mana burn on the Spirit Walker. That Blade Master is flying. Look at this lightning shield. So beautiful. And uh, it's very Tinker esque. Hello. This adds to. This should be his normal outfit, really. The shockwave hits like two dudes of the Talon. This radar from the behind is going down fast. Tinker, is he going to die? He had the healing scroll and a scroll of the beast, by the way, which he could have used to win the game. 
There's a healing scroll used now by the Beastmaster. Without the Tinker, oh, he does have a pocket factory still alive, so he can still fight for now. But the Demon Hunter is in trouble. He has an info potion. Does he use it at any point? No. He just decides to die. I mean, it's his choice. Like, the potion of invulnerability is beautiful. You don't just want to use it just to save your Demon Hunter. Like, what? Why would you do that? The Beastmaster is dead, guys. And it's only dudes of the Titan left here for Sonic. But Sonic, he still has a plan. He has a unit there, and he GG's out. GG's and some no pointer exceptions. Uh, beautiful game by Org Worker. He wins 2 to 1. He's, he's going on to the next round. He will play against the winner of Hawk vs. Effect.